League of Legends is a team-based strategy game developed by Riot Games, where two teams of five champions face off to destroy the other's base. You can choose from over 150 champions with varying playstyles. So how you win the game is by destroying the enemy base and its core nexus. The first team to destroy the enemy's nexus wins the game. In order to do this, you first have to clear the path from defensive structures like turrets and inhibitors. Each lane has three turrets and one inhibitor, and the nexus is also guarded by two turrets. League is over 10 years old, and as so, the players might be a bit hostile towards newcomers. The game has a lot to learn at first, but it feels very rewarding once you get a grasp on it. The game has a very thriving competitive skin with different leagues around the world. The amateur skin is also very active, with Finland having their own pro league as well. At the end of each year, the top teams from each region face off from the title of the best team in the world in the tournament called Worlds. Okay, so after you first start the game, this is the screen that you end up looking like. Uh, for, from here, you can office, of course go and start to play the games from here. And here you can see the multiple game options you have. Uh, for the starting, I recommend that you start with the co-op versus AI, so you're playing with uh, Playing with human uh, teammates, but you're destroy playing against bots, uh, which is which helps you a lot when you're trying to learn the game at first. And here you can see the some options. There's TFT and class. This is the this is one of the game modes that this client also has. And class is like a competitive uh, tournament that you have. It comes around once every month, I think. And then here you can see your profile. You can see some various stats about yourselves, what your what is your rank, your honor level, and your score, and various other stuff that you can see. And then here's the collection that you have collected. Uh, as League is based on champions, you can see all the champions that you have collected. Uh, what are your stats on them? All the skins you have, emotes, runes, spells, items, icons, swords, and chromas. And here's the loot page. So. Every once in a while after you get play, you receive these kind of mastery tokens and keys. There's also this kind of uh, token event going on right now, but you, you gain these tokens by playing the game and completing missions. You can use these tokens to purchase various cosmetic stuff in the game. And uh, here's also the store. So the way you unlock champions in this game is basically you gain this currency called Blue Essence. You get this from leveling up, completing missions, and just by playing the game game itself. And from here, you can buy skin uh, champions that you can unlock for the game. There are a lot of champions. There's almost 200 champions in the game right now. So with the game when you start playing, gives you champions at first, and then you can start unlocking them one by one. You can also buy this currency called uh, Orange, uh, no, RP, which is the Riot Points that you can purchase cosmetic skins for the game. And also some other accessories like uh, basically like rune, uh, rune pages, emotes, ward skins, summoner icons, and other stuff. So once you want to start playing the game itself, uh, this is the screen that you're going to be end up looking like. So this is the champion select page, and here you uh, choose the champion that you want to play with. And uh, from here you can scroll down. Uh, at start you have a lot less options that you can play, but uh, from here you can basically choose the champion that you play for the game. So as you can see, League of Legends has a lot of champions you can play with. Uh, I think I'm just going to choose uh, Etriol for now. And then once you've selected the champion, you can just take a look at the rune pages here, the runes that you want to choose. Uh, this The game itself explains what these are and how these work a lot better. So I'm not going to go over trees, but basically you can choose this kind of... Uh, it's kind of like a talent tree from other games. If, you're, if you've played like MMOs before, you can choose these and they all have different options depending on the champion you play. And here you can choose the summoner spells for yourself as well. So I'm going to choose flash and heal. And then I'm going to lock in my champion. And afterwards, I can still choose the skin that I want to have. As you can see, I have some skins, so I'm just going to choose this one. And here you can also choose the ward skin and the emotes. Uh, and you can change, change these at the champion select. You can also, from the wards and the, and all the skins that you have, 
and the emotes that you have, you can also choose them before the game as well. So this is the uh, the login screen, and this is what it, the game looks like once you've started the game up. So every champion that you play with has uh, four abilities and a passive ability. Uh, from here, you can see that the, my passive ability, so whenever I use an ability, I get 10% attack speed, and this stacks up. Then I have these three basic abilities and an ultimate ability that I unlock at level 6. The maximum level is level 18, and I start with level 1. And from here, uh, you can go to the store here, and you can buy items. And the game nowadays recommends you what items you have. So if you're starting, just starting up, you don't really need to know that much. You can just here take, take a look at what you want. So I'm going to choose the Doran's Blade, which is kind of a good early on item. And here you can also see that there are some consumables. So I'm going to be buying a health potion and also a trinket. So you have three trinket options, and I'm going to choose the yellow one, which is the Stealth Ward. And now I can start going up to a lane. So League is based on this kind of map, which is called the Summoner's Rift. The game map has three lanes, the bot lane, then there's the jungle that has various monsters, like a red buff over here. You can actually go and take a look at it. Then there's the topside jungle. This is the blue buff. Here's the mid, mid lane. And the top lane, of course. And each lane has these towers. And the objective is to destroy the enemy team's nexus, uh, which is, if you can see that our base, this is our nexus. This is our objective is to defend this and prevent the enemy team from destroying this. And when you go from here, this is the enemy team's nexus. And the, once you destroy this, you win the game. But you, if this, if your nexus gets destroyed, you also lose the game. And this is the red buff uh, that, you, that basically gives you, these buffs give you uh, an, an extra Thing you can so for example the red buff gives you a buff that uh, makes you uh, makes you deal more damage on your auto attacks and burn the enemy as well. But yeah, this is basically League of Legends. With you have you have usually have four teammates, and there are different roles in the game. There's the one for top lane, the middle two for the bot lane, uh, basically carry and a support, and then there's the jungle jungle champion as well, who goes around, clears these jungle camps around here, and then helps around the enemy team. But all of this is very much covered in the League of Legends tutorial that is provided by Riot Games. And this is just a very basic overview on what the game looks like. So if you're interested in actually starting the game and playing, uh, I recommend that you go over the tutorial. It explains all the things, concepts like last hitting, how to level your abilities, how the game actually works. The tutorial is very, very comprehensive on that regard. But yeah, this is League of Legends. My name is Sakari, and I thank you for watching.